And that is it. That is it full time. Manchester United have lost against Brighton. Brighton 2, Manchester United 1. This manager is clueless, bro. This manager is clueless. I've had enough with this manager. I, I swear to God. I swear to God, I'm dealt with this manager, bro. I am dealt with this manager. Brighton took the lead uh, through Danny Welbeck. And, and, and we did equalize in 60 minutes from Ahmad Diallo. But then Ja Pedro have won the game in 95 plus minutes. And Brighton take all three points in this match. And look, this Ted Lasso guy, we constantly talking about this guy, constantly making bad decisions. First of all, there's a bunch of things that he did bad today. I will explain that to you. The starting lineup, starting Garnacho, starting Bruno Fernandes as a false nine, and then also starting Harry Maguire, right? Okay, Harry Maguire did not have a bad game, but why are we playing with him? And then why the hell are we playing this game without a striker? I mean, Bruno Fernandes playing as a nine. He's not a goal scorer, bro. He's a, he, he's a number 10. Why the hell are, we, are you using the same formation from, from the previous game? You know that it did not work in the previous game. Yet again, this Ted Lasso guy uses the same lineup today and expecting a different result. And yet again, first half, we're losing the match. And the only difference is he knew he made a bad mistake. He put in Joshua Xerxes and took off Mason Mount. Mason Mount should never have started this game, but he took him off in the second half and United looked better in the second half. We actually looked better in the second half and we equalized thinking that we're going to win this game. Joshua, I mean, look, Ganacho scored in this game in the second half. Okay, let's not forget. A tap in, he scored, but then Joshua Zerxe did touch the ball, which is ruled out for offside. But after that, this manager is clueless. I mean, making bad decisions, taking off Bruno Fernandes, our main creator, our best creator in this, in this team. You take him off to put who? Scott McTominay. What did Scott McTominay do in the second half, bro? What did he do in the second half? I don't know. I seriously, seriously don't know. But this manager has just lost me. I had no faith in this manager. And that continues this season. I said at the start of the season, this manager needs to convince me all over again. I said, I'm going to give him another chance. But take a look at this. Already two games in, we have lost a game. We have lost a game. This should have been at least a draw. Minimum, it should have been a draw. But in the end, we've lost the game. And bad decisions are being made constantly from this manager. And I think he's not going to survive until Christmas. He's not going to survive until Christmas. He brought all the Netherlands players. He brought all the Dutch players. He's, he's had now five or six players from his previous team. And still, the team is struggling to win games. This team is struggling to put Ws. So I've had enough with this manager. I've had enough with this manager. Uh, Anderson says Ten Hag is the next Southgate. Manchester United will sack Ten Hag, says Abdi. Anderson says Ten, ten Hag should be sacked. Uh, Shala says, I remember you said it has to be 2-1 for United. Yeah, I mean, based on, based, on, based on the team we have, we should have won this game, bro. We should have won this game, but this manager is playing against us. He's playing against us, making bad decisions and bad timings. I mean, we need a goal. The game's 1-1. Why the hell are you taking off McTominay? I mean, you're taking off Bruno Fernandes and putting in McTominay. That, that substitution, I just did not understand. I did not understand. And making a defensive change in the 75 minutes. Delict, putting in Delict and taking off Harry Maguire. Harry Maguire did not have a bad game. He should have never started. But then if you start him, just stick with him. You don't make defensive changes. You don't make defensive changes. Basic, basic defending, bro. Like basic, basic defending is costing us this game. How do you take off your captain 10 minutes to go and a game is on the line? That is just ridiculous decision by this manager. And bad result again. Bad, bad result for Manchester United. And I told you consistently this manager is killing us. Consistently, this manager is killing us, bro. I've had enough of him. 